Hello everyone, welcome in this new video and today I want to talk about how to connect Aviva System Platform to an MQTT broker. So on this VM I install Aviva System Platform 2020 and on top of that I install as well Aviva Communication Driver Pack. From there you can see an SMC, we have this Internet of Things MQTT component and from there this the configuration and the broker. So the first thing is to configure the broker with my, or my address of my broker server and I can add as well a group, an MQTT group which I named site01. From there, I can add a, a tags and my device as name. So let's say AI01 with the attribute value. And, and the item reference, this is important. This is your topic, your MQTT topic. From there, I need to activate my OI MQTT component here. From system platform, I want to add the, the MQTT gateway. From there, I can say a name like that, yes. And from there, I open these files and I want to set up the MQTT OIC MQTT server name. And this is the server node is on this local machine. From there, I can just add my tags in the fast group like that. So I just browse the broker, site one, and I can see AI01.value. And this is my tag. So I'll save that. And I will just checking this. I want now to add um, string tags here, and since with this user defined AI01, and I want to as well add my attribute value, which is a string. And from the IO, I will point to this new MQTT tags in the, my MQTT section, like that. That's it, read and write, that's correct. Check in, and after. I will deploy first the MQTT component and after my, my AA tag. After I deploy all the project, I will go to my second machine, which is the broker VM. From there, I will subscribe to my topic. There are the one site, one device one. We can see there's a value pushed to this topic from my simulated Internet of Things devices. I need now to show you on the object viewer of my tags and system platform. I can see here we have the same values across both machines. And I stop my simulated device and I want to show you I can edit this and write this string like 10 or I can edit and add 100 for this tag value so I can read and write. So let's start again the simulator and see here the device is up and running again. So in this demo I show you how to connect to an MQTD broker, in this case Mosquito. Thanks for watching this video today and subscribe to the channel for future videos on cloud and Internet of Things topics. Thanks.